guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Steph. Thank you so much for taking the time to check out my content. I hope you decide to stick around. So don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and become a member of the Soul Squad. We'd love to have you as a part of our family. And also, don't forget to hit the little bell icon to be notified every time I upload, because I upload every week. Let's get into today's video. Squad. For today's video, I'm going to be sharing one of my experiences with you guys, and this is something that you may have experienced yourself, so I figured I would share my story, and hopefully you guys have a story to share with me as well, because I know more often times than not, a lot of people have this kind of experience, and I just thought I would share one of those with you today, which I have several of these experiences as well. Of course, my list is always growing of crazy and weird things that happen to me. I guess crazy and weird people attract crazy and weird things. But, I just wanted to let you guys know my story and see how many of you have experienced something similar. Now, this involves basically knowing what you don't know. So, you know when you have a feeling that something's not right or something, you just follow your intuition, or you just, you know, state something about a place or an object and later on you find out that you are correct. Well, I wanted to share one of the most memorable experiences I have with you guys and see what you think on it and see what experiences you guys have as well because I love hearing from you. So definitely leave it in the comment section below if you had a similar experience. But this particular instance took place when I was traveling with my mom and a friend and we were going to another state for um, a little day out to do a little mini road trip and to go visit some people. And this is somewhere I had never been. I had never been to this particular part of that state and we were just passing by this house. Nobody said anything about the house. Nobody had spoken of anything in the area. Nobody even told me what the specific area we were in was called. But we passed this big white house and I got this terrible feeling of sadness and I was overwhelmed and I basically wanted to cry and I just said that out loud I was like oh my gosh that house gives me a terrible terrible feeling well it just so happened that that house had been the house of a little girl who was in a tragic accident she had planned to go out and get something and she had to cross the street to do so and in the moment she just darted out in front of a vehicle and was hit and she succumbed to her injuries right in that road and supposedly she was buried on that property. But I did not know this at that time. I just said this house gives me a terribly creepy feeling and an overwhelming sadness and that's when the person I was driving just kind of freaked out and was like, oh my gosh, let me tell you what happened there and I can tell you why you're feeling this way. But it's so crazy how many people can pick up on things that they had no knowledge about previously and it happens a lot and to a lot of people and I love to hear these kinds of experiences. So I thought I would touch on my experience and just ask you guys what kind of experiences you've had in this manner like when you know something that you didn't really know and to see what kind of experiences are out there and what you have to tell me about because I'd love to hear from you guys. I love to interact with you guys because you always make my day. But I just wanted to share that little bit of information with you guys and I might go deeper into the story later on if interested. But that's how I found out about this particular site and what went on and supposedly it is known to be haunted by the little girl. So we might get into that on a later date but I just wanted to share my experience and see what you guys have to tell me about with experiences you've had as well in this particular instance where you know something that you didn't originally know. So don't forget to leave that in the comments and I hope you guys enjoyed this little story I just wanted to share it with you guys before I head off to work. Hope you guys are having a great day. Don't forget if you like this video give it a big thumbs up. Also don't forget to subscribe if you've not already and become a member of the Soul Squad. Thank you guys from the bottom of my heart for everything that you guys do for me and all your support and just taking the time to watch my content. You have no idea how much you guys mean to me and I'm so glad that you guys have become a part of my little growing family. So also, don't forget if you have any suggestions or something you'd like to see on this channel to leave it in the comment section below too because this is just as much your channel as it is mine. Hope you're having a lovely day. Always remember, stay humble, stay kind, stay awesome, and I'll see you in my next video.